I am done for the week. Pipe lawyer here. And maybe what I said about the spring-like weather being gone until next spring might have been speaking too soon because it is absolutely gorgeous out here. You got some uh, trails of cloud through the sky, but I mean overall it's just a beautiful blue sky. Absolutely brilliant sun. Got done with court this morning, went home, changed clothes, it's into something a bit more casual. And it is time for this week's edition of Friday Night Pipes. Now, <clears throat> you may have seen a video I did about a week and a half ago about a pipe that my good friend Steve here at Tobacco World had given me. Um, well, it, it was a makeover pipe. And I sent that off uh, to a gentleman in Tennessee who refurbishes pipes and fixes them. And I just got the call this morning well, actually it was last night, but I called them back this morning. Uh, and they wanted to let me know about the status of the pipe. And the pipe has been cleaned, has been refurbished successfully. Um, uh, the bowl was reamed and cleaned. The briar was polished. And the stem, which was the worst part of it, which was, I mean, like a, a, a very drab, brown, greenish, almost like a slime on it, has been cleaned has been completely refurbished and uh, I'm told that uh, some, some other improvements have been made to it so I'm looking forward to sharing that with you in a video as soon as I get it which they told me it was sent this morning uh, via US mail so I should be getting it possibly tomorrow more than likely Monday latest Tuesday but I will be showing you that when it comes in and uh, the gentleman that fixed my pipe goes by the name of Floyd Norwood. And him and his wife, Karen, uh, operate out of Clifton, Tennessee. Uh, Norwood's Pipe Repairs, which is right here. That's their website. Um, but the interesting thing is that not only do they refurbish and fix pipes, but Norwood Pipe Repairs also sells pipes. And they're pipes that are not from, from other brands, but uh, pipes that uh, Floyd Norwood himself actually does make. He actually makes pipes. Uh, the deal is, however, that while he fixes pipes for a living, he only makes pipes for a hobby. So if you go onto his website, you'll see on the uh, hyperlink down at the, uh, I think, the lower left, FLN Pipes. Well, that's for Floyd Norwood Pipes. And you click on that, and it'll take you to a uh, page on their site, norwoodpiperepairs.com, and you'll see maybe about, like, maybe uh, eight pipes. And not too many like, like you would see on, you know, smokingpipes.com or, you know, Boswell's or wh what have you. But uh, very beautiful pipes. Very beautiful. In fact, when I first inquired about getting that uh, makeover pipe refurbished, I went on to Mr. Norwood's website and I looked uh, not only at uh, the, the services that he renders in fixing pipes, but also the actual pipes that he does sell. And uh, came across one. And let me tell you, right off the bat, they're extremely reasonably priced. And I saw one for $40. And I figured, you know, I'm adventurous by nature. So I said, you know what? I'll have that one. And he uses PayPal. He emailed me a uh, PayPal voucher and paid it right up straight away. And I believe it got sent out the next day. And uh, just was now able to go to my P.O. box this week this morning because I've been so tied up in court all week that I haven't had the opportunity to go and check it but uh, they called me last night to see how I liked my new pipe well I couldn't tell them because I hadn't gone to pick it up well I went this morning and I opened my P.O. box and there was a key that led to a larger P.O. box and I went to that box and retrieved the package from uh, Floyd Norwood, Norwood Pipe Repairs. Opened it up, 
and was very pleased at what I found inside. So without further ado, I'd like to introduce this week's newest MVP, Most Valuable Pipe, from NorwoodPipeRepairs.com. It is, as the FedEx truck passes by, it is my new freehand egg. And it is an absolutely beautiful pipe. Not too, too big. I'm not sure if you can catch the grain on that, but it's a nice blonde stain. Very nice. It's got this nice little piece here that kind of like lay, lets it lay down and sit without being a classic sitter. Very nice. And the thing I like about it, it it's, it's light as a feather. And one of the things I like about this pipe, besides the shape and the color, it's got some very gentle plateauing on the bowl. And there goes the FedEx truck. Very gentle plateauing there on the bowl, and also plateauing right there at the end of the shank. But, as with the two pipes that I introduced, or two of the pipes that I spoke about in last week's Friday Night Pipes, this one also has a pearl, let me see if I can see it there. Yes, nice pearl finish stem. Saddle style stem. You see it's got a beautiful pearl gray finish. Look at that. On, on the website, it looked like a solid black, but I spoke with Mr. Norwood on the phone when I was picking out this pipe, and he said that it had a, a nice pearl gray finish, like a marble style look about it. There you go, look at that. I mean, it looks like it's been carved from marble. There you go. That's a good shot right there. See that? And I think it contrasts very well the uh, charcoal marble pearl stem with the blonde finish. And as you can see here, it's got some, oops, it's got some spot carving there. Very Boswell-like. There you see it. Right there. And I'm going to smoke this bad boy for the first time in front of you. The inaugural smoke of the Norwood pipe. Just got my lighter filled up. I'm smoking Pipework and Wilkes's uh, number 191. Hold on, it's kind of windy. Great way to start off the weekend when you got nothing to prepare for. You can relax, you can take it easy and kick back. Very nice. Very nice. Pipe Working Wilkie is number 191. Uh, the cream blend, which I spoke about in an earlier video. Smells like a champ. Brand new. So that's it for this week's edition of Friday Night Pipes. This is Pipe Laura saying cheers. 
Have a great weekend. Next time you see me, I'll be broadcasting from Tennessee. So until next time, once again, cheers. And remember, I'll present the evidence. But you be the judge. Take care. Bye-bye.